Hello everyone and welcome back. We're here today to show you the iTech TES 10 now. This machine has got three huge 2.2 kilowatt motors. It is supplied with all of the tooling required to get you started, including a scribing head. It's got a brand new guard system across the front, which reduces the gap for your hands and keeps you nice and safe. But we're going to take you in for a closer look and show you how it works. So the first point on this machine is the depth stop for your tenon length. As you can see here, you've got a locking handle, you've got your stopper and a scale along the bottom. And all you have to do is slide that along to your desired length. So we're just going to set this to just over 60 millimeters. Tighten the handle up and your preset depth is set. So on the top of the machine here, you can see you've got your two mechanical readouts here, and you've also got very good indicating stickers to show you which head is moving where. You've also got a mechanical scale on the side. If we undo these two locking handles here, this is how you free up the adjustment for both motors. On the first one here, you can see you're moving both the top and the bottom head. So you'll need to preset these to match whatever your section is, whether it's window frames, door frame, sashes, or timber framing. So we're just gonna set the first step at 20 mil here. You can then remove the handle, pop it onto the adjustment for the top head alone. And then what we'll do is we'll also adjust that and this will give us whatever tenon thickness we require. So we're just gonna set that 25 millimeters. We can then lock both handles off. And then our tenon height and thickness is set. So at the front of the machine here, you can see you've got the same setup. You've got a sticker indicating which most is moving. You have a scale and a mechanical readout. So we can put the handle on this side and adjust the step to the desired size we need. So we'll just set this to 20 millimeters as well. And that's all set up. So although we're not setting the scribing block up today, you do have the adjustment for it, which is shown with this mechanical readout. So this is the horizontal adjustment. And then if we go up to the top of the machine, you've also got the vertical adjustment, which you can use to just match the height of your tenon. So our new safety features on this machine is this guarding at the front. So you have these two adjustment handles here, which means you can slide this guard down to match the thickness of your timber. At the front of the guarding on this side here, you can see this adjustment handle. All you simply have to do is slide this Put your timber in and let it close back up that completely closes the gap around the timber so on the main bed of the machine you've got a manual hand clamp this is adjustable with lobe knobs on the side once you've got that to your desired wood thickness you simply clamp it in and that completely holds the material in position you have this fence along the back here which your material rests against as you can see from this groove you've also got the capacity to do angled tenons on this as well so the signage on this machine is really helpful. At the front here, you can see for each motor what the maximum diameter of your cutter heads can possibly be. So here are the main controls for the machine. It is really straightforward to use. You've got each start and stop button labeled up for their motors, an emergency stop button, and a stop button to stop all the motors at the exact same time. And then down here at the bottom, you've also got a kick stop for safety as well. So now it's time to set up the machine ready for our timber. Normally you would also have a sacrificial fence to stop break out of the rear of the timber, but we're not gonna worry about that today for the video.
So to access your tools for changing them over and for general maintenance, you need to remove this front cover at the top. You can then simply just lift the bed up, swing the arm out of the way and drop it down. Then you've got access to all of the tooling so you can change them, sharpen them. So there you have it. We've just shown you the iTech 3-head TES Tenoner. Uh, we've shown you a very basic amount of the, what this machine is capable of. It is capable of so much more. If you have any questions, you want to come in for a demonstration, please feel free to give us a call or send us an email.